So what do we have here? Um, let's see. This is POP. This is POP. This is P this is definitely POP. And this is surface. So we'll get to see the inside of all these in a bit. This is also POP. Let me see. It looks like of course is six was POP. Of course, this is definitely POP. So let's get to the video. Welcome to my channel. My name is Cordelia and you are <laughs> you are in the right place. So today I'll be showing you some of these POP designs. I'll be talking about a lot of things just like the intro says, the sizes, the installation method and all that. So let's get to the video. If you are just coming here for the first time and have not subscribed, please if you like content like this please subscribe and every time i drop new video you will get to see it okay let's dive in so panel lights are these new ceiling lightings you are seeing on the screen right now which has replaced our traditional fluorescent lightings and we have many forms of panel lights and we are looking at some of them today we will look at their sizes we will look at their usage we will look at their installation method we will look at their prices in the markets yes we'll tell you the prices of these panel lights in the market how much you can get it so you can do you can stay in your home and do estimates for your for your project if you're getting these panel lights for your project for your housing project so stick to the end so you don't miss anything so the two main types of panel lights you have is recess panel light and surface panel light and recess panel light is also referred to as pop this is recess panel light this is pop recess panel light also called the pop the same as this So, like I was saying before I was interrupted, this is the um, POPs, look at them, look at the back, back of the POPs, very, very flat, unlike the surface lights, unlike the surface light, POPs are flat. This is the sample of the surface that I have here. And bring this thing down. So this is the sample of surface that I have here. See. So this from this packet. Like this you can see the shape of the P POP is definitely different from the surface. This is the surface. I think I still have some here. I know you told your friend you're yes. not okay. Yes. And tell me what's wrong, why you never said you felt that way. So this is another this is for us. Another design, another branch rather. So this is surface lights, as you can see, is thicker than the POP. POP is flat, white surface is thick. So let's look at their installation method. Installa but I think I should give you the sizes first. Let's talk about the sizes of this uh, POP and the uh, surface. They have uniform sizes actually. And the biggest size of POP is 24 watts. 24 watts POP, I'll put it on the screen. 24 watts POP, then followed by 18 watts POP. 18 watts POP, then followed by then followed by um 12 watts. 12 watts POP. This is 12 watts POP. Sorry, it's very dirty. I just picked this one song somewhere at her warehouse just lying on the ground there. Then after 12 watts. Followed by six was Let's you can see the sizes. You can see the sizes. Big, bigger, biggest. 
this 18 was this 12 was this six was and the last one of the on the line is three watts this is three watts POP. Actually, that is three. not three watts POP. Three watts POP is smaller than that one. Something like this. You can see it's much smaller than that one. You can see the sizes. And we'll have it like that in the surface. But the surface, the only two two sizes I have here. I think I'll put the rest on the screen. The only two sizes I have here is um 12 watts, which I just brought up earlier and 6 watts 12 watts and 6 watts 12 watts and 6 watts so look at their back how they are you connect this to the electricity this is also used for the installation where you put it on the wall so let's get on with their installation method more and more fantastic designs are being created every day in the recent modern fall ceiling decorations and these panel lights we are reviewing today play key roles in all of these designs as you can see on your screen what we we'll have here on this fall ceiling decorations are panel lights call them fall ceiling decorations here in nigeria many people call it um, um many people call it um and um, decking ceiling many people call it decking ceiling it's also known as fall ceiling decorations so what we we'll have in this particular decking ceiling is six watts pop is six watts pop all through apart from the hidden yellow lights behind the ceiling and this one is mostly three watts pop you can see how tiny they are mostly three watts pop all through used in the design apart from the hidden lights also these panel lights are now being used everywhere on new buildings in Nigeria now, on most buildings that are going up now. Because of its beauty on buildings, it's easy to install and you can buy it anywhere in Nigeria now. You may not need to go to the market. The shops on the streets have them. At least many of them that sell lightings, they have it. To install a POP, you have to cut a round hole on your ceiling, like this one you're looking at right now. Measure the round hole to cut from the back of the POP. The whole size to cut in your ceiling must not exceed the required point. If you're an engineer or electrician, you probably already know the whole size to cut for each POP size, so you don't need to start measuring it. So next, you connect the wires. Connect the wires behind the POP to the electricity supply. When I'm alone with you, I never feel lucid. I wish I wasn't struck by Cupid. I wish when I first saw you. Pass the two hooks to the other side and you are done. I feel diluted, my heart's been wounded. Silhouettes of you are like a time. You see how simple it is? Cut your hole, connect your wires in the POP to the electricity supply then make only the hooks enter the hole and you are done very simple you don't understand the pain of brains you don't ever want to give me wings you don't ever want to set me free but if i lay down and i play dead and i stay dead baby you'll get sick of being the monster out of my head under my bed think you're something So this is an example of where POP is installed inside a hall, in a big sitting room or hall like this. They first cut the hole. First cut the hole. You see the holes are made all over where they need the POP to be installed. And the wires for the electricity supply is already passed out to connect the POPs. As you can see all over, the wires are out to connect the POPs. So the wires already joined past the hooks and there it is, very simple. Like this, the rest of the holes are fitted with their own POPs and ready to go. Here you go, wonderful right?
very beautiful. I love this PO piece. Very beautiful. So what if what you have is cemented ceiling and it's difficult to bore holes in them? What you have is decking. What will you do? So if what you have is decking, that's your ceiling is cemented, it's not uh, wooden like this one in the picture, then you have to build one of these four ceiling um, designs. You have to build one of these four ceiling designs or you can make it like this, very simple. No, just a plain wood like that there are other simple designs you can make just like these ones or you can just create a carved wood in circle shape or square shape like this one we are seeing and you install your POPs it's simple like that just a center design at the center of the room you don't need to cover the whole room just a center design to install your POPs and those simple center designs will not cost you much to create or install oh <laughs> I'm so sorry I <laughs> I showed you only the 12 was and uh, 6 was I'll put the rest on the screen there are definitely the same number of sizes as the um, POP so we have the 30 was not really yes we have the 30 was um, surface we we'll have the um, 18 watt surface and we have the 12 watt surface sorry we have the 12 watt surface and the 6 watt surface so the those are four sizes 30 watts 18 watts 12 watts and the 6 watt surface those are the sizes of the surface light just like we we'll have how many four sizes in the pop so, when you open a packet of surface panel light, this is the bracket and nuts that it must come with. This iron here, that's what you use to fix it. The bracket and nut that it must come with. And this screw down on the table, it must come with it. That is what you use to fix it. So we are fixing it on this table right now. So consider this your ceiling. So follow us as we fix it. First of all, mark these two points out with the brackets and bore your hole where you screw the brackets in after making the hole then use your screwdriver to screw this bracket into the hole you have made look at the knots that came with the packets so you use this knot to screw the bracket in into the wood. Oh, sorry, this is not a um, knot. This is screw nails. Screw nails. So you use the screw nails, which came with the surface light, to screw the brackets in first before attaching the lights. So let's screw it in. So you consider this table as your ceiling. Whatever you do on this table is what you'll be doing on your ceiling to fix your um, surface lights. So now you're done with this, you take your surface lights. Um, first of all, before you put it on, you have to pass this wire through these holes that are here pass this wire because the whole round place will cover the whole area nowhere to pass the wire this why these holes are made you pass the wire out this is where you connect your electricity so you can now cover it and screw it in but if your electricity is coming from the inside that the wire is not on the outside the wire supplying the electricity is not on the outside. You don't need to pass the wire outside. Just connect it from the inside. So this is the hole where you will tighten it to the bracket you have screwed to the wall. And this is the screw that came with it for this area, for this side. So you screw the bracket 
to the surface light like this. You do same for the other side as well with the same screw you hold the other side of the bracket to the surface light to hold it in place so when you are done with that with this wire that we have channeled out of these holes for the electricity you connect it to your electricity and that's all your light has been installed completely wow isn't this beautiful very beautiful and very simple to install very nice so you might say why going through the trouble of making holes here and there all over the room just to install these lights pops when you can easily install surface you know without making any holes for them the answer is very simple most of these beautiful four ceiling designs are produced with POPs. Trust me, they won't look this gorgeous if they are designed with surface lights. <laughs> they won't even near gorgeous. All of these are done with POPs. So, on that note, where are surface lights best fitted in a building? Please, if you have the answer, give me in the comments section below before you continue watching. Where are surface lights best suited in the building? If you're enjoying this video so far, smash that like button below. Give us a like as we continue. Surface look more beautiful in the exterior places of a building like the balcony, the veranda, the passage, back of the building walls, anywhere that is not inside, it looks very cute. Besides, you won't start constructing decking ceiling in your corridor or veranda just to put POP. Surface lights are also good in the corridor like we said before, kitchen area and the staircase area and the bathrooms yes the bathrooms they are very good in the bathrooms so guys if you have any questions so far don't forget to give me in the comment section below and check out the description below i will be dropping links or where to get these surface lights both both retail and the wholesale prices um, i'll put them on the link below so so for us to talk about the prices of these panel lights um guys i'm so sorry this video has taken too long let's talk about the prices in the next video just click next and watch the next video where we talk about the prices and other things concerning the panel lights thank you for watching please don't forget to subscribe love is free subscribe and like the video so that more people get to see it on youtube and you get to see my next videos thank you for watching God bless you. See you in the next video. God bless you.